All right, I'm gonna do a quick material demonstration for Creativity Pass with Control 3B from Peak Generalization. For this program, you're just gonna need um, that grid paper that we've used for other paths with control programs like 14i. And we have a five by five for our train, which is shown on here. And then we have a six by six on our test grid like this with our A to B already on there. So you can print out multiple copies of that to have permanent products. You could laminate it and use dry erase markers. Um, and a little tip we've realized with using the lamination paper with things like this, the magic erasers are amazing to get that um, kind of film and residue off of there from the markers. So just a little tip. Um, but for this program, you're just going to need these grids and multiple markers. Um, again, you're already going to have them labeled in the top left and bottom right with A and B. And you're going to instruct the participant to draw a path for train and test. It's going to be the same way. You're going to tell them to make a path from A to B. And they're going to draw their path. Then you're going to have one marker for same and one marker for different without telling them. So in the demonstration that we did on this, um, so our green marker was the same and our red marker was different. So you're going to have them draw that original path. Then you're going to hand them the colored marker and tell them to good, now draw another path. They need to be paying attention to if they have that green or red marker in their hand and whether or not it should be a same or different path. For train, you're obviously going to be teaching it, reinforcing, giving feedback, things like that. And then on test, you're not giving any prompting feedback or reinforcement, and you're just scoring either a 0 or 10 if they were able to demonstrate that skill yet or not. Um, with generalization and peak, just keep in mind, again, you're intermixing train and test within a block. Um, so maybe set up your data sheets accordingly to cross out that 2, 4, and 8 um, for test um, blocks or test um, like trial numbers so that you kind of keep track that those are ones that you're not prompting or giving any feedback during. Um, so again, that's just kind of a quick material sample. You just really need markers and grid paper um, for this peak generalization creativity pass with control 3B.